Okay, we had a question about this, the locus of the center of a circle that makes an intercept of length 2a on the x-axis and passes through the point 0, comma b is, we've got four options. So let's uh, so show how this can be solved. Um, first, we start with the general equation of a circle, x squared plus y squared plus 2gx plus 2fy plus c equal to 0. We know that the center here is minus g, comma minus f. We know that the intercept on the x-axis of this circle is 2 times the square root of g squared minus c. Uh, we've been given that is equal to 2a, so equating that to 2a, uh, we can square and get g squared is equal to a squared plus c. And uh, remember that g squared is the same as minus g whole squared, so replacing that there. And then making c as the uh, subject of the equation, we get c is equal to minus g whole squared minus a squared. Now the circle passes through 0 comma b. So, uh, so plugging in x equal to 0, y equal to b in the equation of the circle, we get 0 squared plus b squared plus 2g times 0 plus 2f times b plus c is equal to 0. Um, that gives us b squared minus 2b times minus f plus c is equal to 0. And again making c the uh, subject of the equation we get c is equal to 2b times minus f minus b squared. So the two equations we are dealing with are here. c is equal to minus g whole squared minus a squared and c is equal to 2b times minus f minus b squared. Since the two left hand sides are the same, we equate the two right hand sides. Yeah, so we get this equation. Uh, rearranging, we'll get minus g whole squared is equal to a squared minus b squared plus 2b times minus f. Now, we have to remember that the center of the circle is minus g comma minus f, which means we can generalize this equation now to obtain the locus. The locus is x squared is equal to a squared minus b squared plus 2by.